Hey guys, this is Capstan Jankos. We are here for the last Cap Recast of the year, uh, presented by BMW. And um, we just came off a rough series. So uh, how do you feel right now? Feeling pretty great. <laughs> of course, we're disappointed in ourselves, um, in myself. Um, the year was not what we wished for, right? We didn't make it to Maasai. We didn't even make it to Worlds now, so we didn't even place top three in Summer Split. I think it's personally a disaster. Um, I don't think any of us wished for that, right? All of us were trying very, very hard, at least in Summer Split. But uh, we just fell short, and yeah, it seems like we were just not good. Yeah. Um, on the other hand, Fnatic, uh, another BMW, United rivalry team, uh, and SKT also made Worlds. So, what do you think about the other BMW teams as well? Yeah, I mean, I wish um, FPX the best of luck if they make it, and then SKT as well, because they already made it right with Faker. Faker back to Worlds, that's pretty hype. I'm uh, gonna watch it from my couch, and then. Um, of course, there is also uh, Fnatic, which just uh, qualified. I wish also them the best of luck. In the end, we are competitors, so we hate each or like we don't hate each other, but we compete against each other during the season. But um, we want Europe to do the best they can do, right? Uh, now heading into Worlds, so um, especially to Fnatic since they are one of the BMW teams, but also to uh, Mad Lions and Rogue. Uh, we definitely wish them the best of luck, and we hope that uh, they can bring the trophy home. Uh, something we couldn't do the past couple of years. Yeah, I mean, just wishing everyone everyone the best of luck, especially as you mentioned the European teams. Uh, and other than that, I guess that's the the new matches to look forward to. Who do you think will win EU? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, I don't actually care. <laughs> okay, so I think um, I think Europe. I think Mad Lions. I assume. I think they are actually the best team. Uh, looking at how they play, um, they also showed a lot of mental resilience. So. I think my line is probably the best, and I think second best could be Fnatic Rogue. I don't really know. Uh, Rogue could slightly tweak their playstyle, assuming what happened last week. And I feel like still Fnatic is from these three teams. I think Fnatic is like the most exploitable if we actually are willing to play champions. So I think that um, they should take the win, Rogue, and Fnatic should be the third. Uh, meanwhile, Rogue the second, and uh, Mad Lions the the first team to represent Europe and also finish the season. Will be interesting to see next week how things will turn down, and uh, any f other thoughts about the the season or the year? Yeah, I mean, I guess good luck to Cloud9, right? They are the last uh, BMW representative that will fight for Worlds today, actually. Um, so good luck to Perx. Hope he can make it out of the old uh, G2 crew. And besides that, um, apologize to all the fans. Um, kind of feels always weird to apologize because it really feels like we. I mean. I feel like I did, or like at least I feel like I did everything I could to win, and I assume it's same for my teammates. Like we tried really hard, right? Uh, and we just fell short, so it feels bad to lose, and it's very disappointing, and it's a disaster. But at the same time, if you know you did your best, you don't feel as bad. So at least the feeling after the loss is that I tried, and we tried, and yeah, I mean they were just better, right? And we will look to come back stronger next year. Um, but I think that's gonna be it for us this year. So see you next year.